thanks for coming back, everyone. Kit, this has been a fascinating conversation as we've been talking about how we're using our security as a service offering to help our customers and really improve their security posture. And while I love the example of improved perimeter protection, I know you've also been working with something near and dear to both of our hearts, K through 12 schools, right? Yep. Tell us a little bit about some of the conversations you've been having around K through 12 schools and how our security as a service comprehensive offering is helping them focus on their jobs, yep. right? Provide a safe environment and really, you know, kind of do what they're supposed to do, educate our kids. Yeah, Steve, the uh, K through 12, uh, segment is an area that we've found has literally been thrown into the high tech world um, from, you know, basically from books to full on laptops and cloud based everything um, for all of their students and without actually building out a whole IT organization to support it. Um, and so really our security as a service solution is designed to really enable those schools to not have to worry about any of their security uh, technology, to really just have it as a tool to enhance and secure their facilities, to ensure that kids can focus on learning, and that when people do show up to those facilities, they know that it is a safe and secure location. And that's really the main, the main focus of everything we want to do for the schools is to to allow them to get back to focusing on the kids and not like being a system administrator or something like that. Well, I think it ties into our culture so nicely, right? Kind of being one, our customer's best service provider, being engaged in our communities. And I think you brought up a really good point that, you know, these schools are supposed to be focused on educating our kids. They don't have a deep staff. So having a partner like us that can really, you know, really manage their technology that they can trust and rely on. I mean, I mean, I just got to imagine that some of the headmasters, some of the principals, mm -hmm. some of the administration that you've been talking with has been pretty, you know, positive reaction from what we've been discussing. Yeah, it resonates really well with them. Um, the combination of everything that we bring to the table as far as service and technology, and and just the the leadership and guidance that we can help provide right like just becoming a, a true trusted advisor to those to those schools um, and the leaders that are responsible for those schools because in the end they are um, everybody who has a child in those schools looks to them to be making these decisions to taking steps to enhance and build out a, a better more secure world for their students and you know it's always changing right like we see all these different threats to our schools uh, over and over again in different varying ways and we have found and, and studies have found over the last you know 25 years that if you put a strong perimeter around anything that you want to protect and secure that you're gonna have better outcomes and that's really what we focused on, right? Like it's just the basics for the schools because they don't have that yet. Right, and I think the difference that our security as a service offering brings is that remote health monitoring feature set, right? So that we're actively looking at the system uptime, yeah. the system performance, making sure that any system technology that is deployed is actually functioning. Because yeah. that's, you know, that's really been the gap in that environment. They don't have the time to sit in front of a screen Right. So instead, we're just automating that whole process using our monitoring center capability to you know, really provide that peace of mind that the customer is looking for. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's an interest. It's a great, great fact. I mean, having the ability to, to expand that team, right, like from uh, a convergent side, from a central station side, um, even from some of our application providers that we partner with. Um, all of those people can be part of that solution and Convergent really orchestrating all of that based on the customer needs and wants. And that's really, you know, that's where the security as a service solution really starts to shine. And to further kind of like the exact same example, like you said, is like having all that done remotely is when you look at a school, it's not like an office building where you've got like a, a security operations center in a in you know in a room that's manned 24 7 it's right. that doesn't happen so the ability to have all of this information available on a mobile device or pretty much any device yeah. 
is a huge advantage to the teachers, the staff, um, even the students, because they can have mobile credentials that can then open like a, a front gate or a, ba a card uh, access reader to unlock the door. It's this combination of really kind of elevating everybody um, in that whole chain of events to use the most advanced and trusted technology that's out there today. Well, and I think that's the fun part of being that system integrator that ties all those pieces together, bringing the right solution to the right application, and really being a, a consultant to our customer, providing them that peace of mind, that confidence that they can you know, have convergent, the world's you know, global leader in system integration, right? Right there to help and support them along that process. Yeah. Well, I, it's been so exciting talking to you about some of the different applications you've been working on with some of our customers. We could go on and on, but again, everyone, thanks for joining us. We've got so much to share with you. Please come back next week as we continue the conversation. Have a great day.